So, this is a place, huh? It's, um, nice. Spacious. The catch looks comfy. Uh, uh, um, I'm sorry. This place doesn't look familiar to me at all. I know you're trying nothing. Yeah, okay. I'll take a seat. Wow. You actually have photo albums? Like printed photos? It's definitely old school. Oh, I said that? No, I mean, I could have, I guess. I just don't feel like that's me. Photo album seems like a waste of space, honestly. Sorry, it sounded like a jerk, didn't I? It's really not my intention. Okay, so I met you back in college. Sociology, right. Oh, is that us? On a boat? Your smile is really pretty in that picture. I just mean, ever since I met you, you've only been frowning or doing that fake smile shit. I mean... I get why you're upset. Sorry. Okay. Let's look at another. Wait. Is that me wearing Mickey ears? <laughs> uh, this can't be me. I mean, I would never be caught dead at Disneyland. Really? I did. That's crazy. But I guess if you have proof, it happened. Oh, no. I just remember the song. Nothing much. Just remember hearing it in the car going. going. Damn it. Every time I reach for it, it's gone. Don't start. Don't tell me I'll get better. You don't know that. When you see me, you don't see me. You see this woman. This woman who asked you to Disney, even though she hates theme parks. I'm not that woman. Listen, um, I appreciate what you're trying to do. But it's been a few weeks since I've been out of the hospital, and I still don't remember you. And at this point, I'm not sure if I ever will. Shit, I'm sorry. That came out wrong. God, why do I keep saying stupid things? I just mean... We should be realistic. You seem like a fantastic person. And I don't want you chasing the ghost of a girlfriend you used to have. Please don't cry. For what it's worth, I really do wish I remembered. These pictures? I don't think I've ever been as happy. But the fact of the matter is, I don't know you. 
think it's best if I go? No, it's fine. Um, I have your number, so if I remember something, I'll call you. This is weird. I'm sorry. I wish I was that woman. My heart's breaking for you. Please don't cry. I'll stay for some coffee. Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Look, um, have you been taking care of yourself? I heard you were with me in the hospital for the week I was in a coma. And ever since I woke up, you've been there every time I was awake. You must be exhausted. You... You usually say that, right? That you're fine when you're not. I just feel like you do. I don't know. Hey, you're swaying. You should sit down. Oh, fuck. They fainted. What do I do? Should I call someone? I mean, has this ever happened? Oh, fuck. <sighs> my head fucking hurts. Oh, it's like a drill going through my skull. <sighs> okay. It's gone. Man, what was that? What's going on? I feel kind of fuzzy. Babe? Baby, what are you doing on the floor? Hey, come on. Please open your eyes. I'm begging you. Don't leave me like this. I'm back now. You've got to give me hell for this. Hey, there you are. Are you okay? Yeah? You sure? It's me. Yeah, it is. Oh god, come here. I'm so sorry. I've got you. Yeah, baby, I remember. I don't know. I just saw you go down and then, bam, came back. Are you okay? No, oh, baby, you've been pushing yourself too hard. I know, I know. I didn't mean to scare you. But you gave me a scare too. Serves me right, huh? No, I remember. Some parts of it are still a little fuzzy. But I know you. I love you. I don't know how I could ever forget. Come on. No, I'm not letting go. I'm taking you to bed. Yeah, well, as fun as that sounds, I don't think you're up for that yet. You need some rest. Shh. I'm not going anywhere. I'll be right here holding you. Promise. Okay. There we go. Nice and Come here. I know. I'm not going anywhere. You can close your eyes. I'll still be here. Baby, please. You need some rest. You've been taking point this whole time. You can let go now. Just for a bit. And when you're awake, you can drag me back down to the doctor 
and run some more tests to make sure this is a permanent thing. Okay, okay, I'll prove it. Our third date? You wore those uh, Dr. Martins. They were brand new, and you wore them all night. But when I was walking you back to your dorm, you were limping and you pulled out these faded purple flip-flops. You smirked at me and said, Key is to always be prepared. And that's when I knew. This was the person I wanted to spend my whole life with. It's true. Okay. Enough stories. You need to sleep. I've got you. No. I won't let go. I'm never letting you go. Get some rest, love. Thank you.